feels so good to be playing this again. Pretty much one of the first Roblox games I ever played. And I wasn't very good at it. But hey, I'm pretty much a professional now, so you don't need to worry about anything. Oh, look, it's full of secret areas, ancient treasures, and dark secrets. How dark are they? Because I'm gonna be able to handle it. Just like for gold coins, for inventory, and pick up, trading for cash. Hidden items which you can pick up. For quests and valuable to sell. And drowning. Here we are. This is a little man. Ready to start his big diving adventure. Before we do anything, I'm pretty sure there's like a quest over here. Gold coin shopping inventory. I know. It's kind of being blocked off by like the menu HUD, so I can't really see that much. Hopefully it fixes itself. Wow, it's been like two years, I still have the egg hunt quest here. Alright. We need to retrieve an artifact. Egg of Cthulhu. I don't think it even gives you the egg anymore, but you can still do it. For some quick money. I'm also gonna go up here. I need this. Power suit schematic added. Here we are. The egg's in there. We got a note. How do I check those again? There we go. No. Jet with the force field. To unlock the force field, ask for this HDA. Receive the red and blue keys for the two sides that are in place on their pedestals. Sounds easy enough. Oh, yeah, we've got to play like mm, this kind of thing. Oh, this might take a while. There we go. Alright, this is the first key. Yeah, and it also, t uh, yeah, the game tells you people's progress because it tells them who bought who and, um... I don't think anyone here really speaks. So we're like trying to strike up a conversation here. Platforming. Oh my god, damn natural. There we go. Stop roaring, thank you. Here you go. Claim a reward. 50 cash? I thought it was 100 before. Well, I guess that's enough. Uh, hello, sir. Can I sell my stuff? Can I buy stuff here? Um, white treasure chest keys and a bigger backpack. That's all mine, though. Hello, miss. Yep. She's lost something in the lake. She lost a necklace. So now we are going to find it for her. Some guy here, I'm pretty sure he has a quest as well. Where's he here? Looking treasure. Oh yeah, the guitar! I like this because it sometimes plays Zelda themes. By the way, Tears the Kingdom is great so far. Please go buy it if you can. Yeah, let's actually dive now. This guy is really trying to hold the treasure chest. It tells you that you don't have any keys. Whoop. Also, I like the music in this game. It's very surreal and peaceful. It's just a really nice, relaxing game for me to play every now and again. Yep, I've got five pins in my bag. That's the final. F okay, I can't really collect. Okay, now I can't really collect any more stuff because my bag is full. So I'm gonna scavenge up some more coins. I'll come back for that later. Yeah, we're ready to sell. 113 coins. Sheesh. So I think I want to buy some more stuff from you. Backpack 2. And the fast travels. Now we've completely sold the pawn shop. First I'm going to pick up this while I'm at it. There's another thing down here. Another thing right there. It's been like, it's been like a year since I played this. How do I still remember all these stuff? My muscle memory for this game is like next level. I'm going to drown. But then again, I almost... Pretty much did that in some order anyway. Celtic necklace should be here. Oh no, that's the red cliff pendant. Well, not everything is top notch. We get some stuff wrong every now and again. Binoculars. And there's the necklace down there. Treasure chest. 
There we go. Now we can sell again. I don't think I'm gonna buy anything this time around because there's still some more stuff I wanna come around and collect. I don't think I need a boat right this very second. Yeah, that will come in that will come in handy for setting like warp points. Oh, we've got our silver star crown. I'm pretty sure this cave leads off to like a little enclosed space. So I'm pretty sure it's this one anyway. Oh, it's very dark in here. It tells me I need a flashlight, but I don't need it. Oh, I don't need to go up there to get some air. By the way, something I want to point out is um, I'm playing this game on max graphics. I don't usually play games in max graphics, but um, this one just looks really nice, and I just couldn't play this without max graphics, honestly. We've got the journal, we've got the pilot's journal over here. July 20, 1920. A crash! I don't know what happened. Fuel was high, wind was normal, everything was business, as usual. Three hours into my 14 hour flight. 14 hour flight? Jesus. That's a long time. I breached the tip of this mountain, have a look at the lake below, and I remember thinking, huh, this lake isn't on my, top on my topography map. I should write a letter to my agency immediately. Or to the edge of my registry. No. Immediately following this, the plane just goes haywire. Fuel drops to nothing, winds start flapping like crazy, all my indicators start flashing, the gauge went like crazy, and the plane goes down. I'm lucky to have survived, but my real test starts now. I just hope my survival train holds up. Well, I don't know if he's alive or not. You, you never know if these guys survived or not. Oh, yeah, I forgot I have the, I have the fast travel, don't I? I don't need to walk all the way back. <laughs> 68 bucks, oh, I should have grabbed to collect one more coin for the good old 69. Hey, 30 cash. Like, free dive training, cloth suit, like the flashlight. Hello, right, sir. Lumberjack. Yep. I'm looking for a split of sapphire crystal in this cave. So, yep, I'm going to, um, Look for the crystal now. Unfortunately, the flashlight in this game is like the classic Roblox flashlight, and yeah, it doesn't work so well on mobile. Pretty sure there is something in that chest over there. Yep, a bejeweled necklace with a journal. Read that. Day two, our adventure at Quill Lake. Quill Lake. I can't believe we finally managed to get out of the city and take this trip. What a perfect location for a getaway. The area is so beautiful and the people here are so accommodating. Yesterday we went swimming, and today Robin wanted to go spelunking. We came through the abandoned mine and are now in some sort of waterlogged cave. I'm writing this from the glow of my headlight. Apparently, some people rappel down from these large openings in walls from rock climbing. Crazy, I've never done something like that. Hold on. Is that growling? Yep, and then the note just ended there. Yeah, because there's supposedly, according to the law, there's something inside this cave. Though, thankfully, it never comes out. Dime, you got some TNT. I almost call it dynamite, because it does look like dynamite. And we've got the sapphire crystal. We've got a valuable items note. Let's have a look at it real quick. We're not gonna, t we're not really gonna find any of these, although I think we'll find them either way. However, we are going to go to the abandoned workshop. I know my way around there. I don't think I need scuba gear to do it. Hello there. So it's a railroad project meant to go to the valley, but it got cancelled since it got to the lake. And nobody knows they cancelled it. It's also very dangerous. Well, let's not into the later sections. There's nothing really too important about this one, just let you have a read of it in your own time. I'm choosing to read the ones I like, okay? And I'll let you read the rest. Yep, I'll take a look at pass. Pretty sure the entrance to the cave we're supposed to go into is just like... ...around here, or something. Well, it's not here, but um... I've got some stuff to collect. Which is always nice. And there's the cave entrance. Scavenge that ship first, get some coins, some air, and then we'll go in. And we're zooming up. So yeah, and we're zooming back down. And just like that, we're good to go. Yep. It's not okay. In fact, I'm pretty sure I did a full circle. 
Well, there's actually no way I got myself lost in this cave. Wait, hold on. Optimal, optimal, getting lost. Bruh. Oh, great, and I disconnected. Um, give me like two seconds. A few moments later. Hey, I was up here, I just completely missed this pathway. I really actually like coming to this spot every once in a while because it gives me a nice overview of the lake. And. Uh, I just love, I really just enjoy this game, in case you can tell. Now we've got to do an obstacle course to get to the workshop because, um, I guess the engineer here just I couldn't build a fucking bridge, I guess, I don't know. Here, we're going to collect everything that's here. Map log, mecha blocks, a good start, functions well on steam power, limited by weak materials, fragile, gentle, gentle robot, an excellent butler. Not a great fighting machine, however. <laughs> Fun droid. Working well on high energy usage. Find a way to reduce power consumption. Powerful blaster. Blue droid. I must have asked more yet. Efficiently consumes a moderate amount of power. Robust. Smart AI. This could be the kind of model I need. Go up, I guess we're just like working at ultimate power or something. I don't really know. Ooh, we've got the stuff that's sell it. Special DM free drive training areas around here. Yep. I can afford scuba gear right now, but um. I want to scope up the free dive training area using, well, my free dive training. Not really big, in fact, I pretty much scouted almost the entire area in a single breath. Oh my god, it's the best thing in the game, it's the best treasure! The caramel apple! Oh my god. This will get me so much money! Anyway, we've got the stuff, now we can sell. Now it's time to actually buy the scuba gear. Scuba gear. We've got a badge for that. Now we're ready to take on the world. Moving the boat a bit forward, right around here. This should place me on top of the pirate ship. What's the supplies of that I want to get? Yeah, we are now speedy in the water. Down we go. Yep, this is pretty much right where I thought I'd be. And oh my lord, I am zooming in the water. Oh, I don't think I was even going this fast a year ago. Did they like buff this or something? Holy! Let's go into the temple, the underwater temple, and steal all the riches from it. Oh, and the dragon clown, we can't forget about that. That's not a crown, it's a forgotten relic. The oxygen doesn't last too long, I think. It lasts around, um, Seven minutes, I believe. I don't know. The pirate area. We can't go in there yet, but we will be able to soon. Got the Lair of Air. The sunken ship. Let's just take all the riches now. I'll let you read this one as well. Right now, actually going into the ship. I'm sure there should be a bit of treasure here. There's a tank there, which reveals our error a bit. I'm not really going to be picking those up because I'm. Um, I'm pretty sure there's only three of those in the entire game. Yeah, there's the cave with the guitar. Got a royal crown. Oh, so this lake is kind of contaminated because somehow. Yeah, that somehow got in here. Not sure how any of the ships got in this lake. I guess massive storms could kind of make these kind of vessels wash up into lakes, but I don't know. About your mission, treasure. I claimed it. <laughs> if you really want it. Maybe we could make a deal. Coming from the pirate area, just aside the interest of the pirate cove. Yeah, we can't go there just yet. If you think about it, this is kind of like an RPG or something. Or kind of like a Metroidvania. Where you don't have- where you need to get and scavenge off money to buy the thing and then come back and then... scavenge around there. So this is kind of like... the closest thing we have to an underwater Metroidvania, at least the closest I have. Yep, we've got power suit scrap. Got a golden rod Bloxian. Just call it a Bloxy. It's pretty much just a Bloxy. And that's not exactly like a Bloxy award, but um... Might as well. Bro, I'm gonna get like so much money from all this stuff. Also, my air's almost low, so I gotta... Yeah. Well, there's something over there, I have to come back to that later. For now, let's just sell everything we have. This is probably gonna make profit. 321 bucks! Holy, that's a lot. Right, now we're at the shack. Three for a rare tank. Where's Merlin? We'll talk to him. Hello? You're very friendly, are you? Sorry. It's just I have to talk to people like you all the time. You even look the same. <laughs> Bit of self-awareness there. 
expert Merlin, an expert with specialized scuba suits. And yep. We just talks over there, but if you the parts, there's one powerful super scuba could build you. Yep, the super scuba. Outfitted for pressure resistance and equipped with torsion checks. It's perfect for deep sea diving. And giving up the details. Bring me hand, I'll build it for you for five more cash. Yep. To build the power suit, you must find one power suit scrap. Got that. One power cell from a sunken cargo ship. I'm on my way to that. One lava reactor from the depths of a volcanic cave. Yep, one with that as well. And power suit scrap from an ancient tower. You've already got two of the four parts. It's kind of easy to build the thing. There's two notes over there. I'll let you read this. And I'll read this myself. March 30th, 2015. My journey ends. The deep sea, a place of mystery. In an area that's already so puzzling. The deep sea is the place that's the most curious. I believe I can find answers there. About all of this, the unexplained events, the curious stories, the secrets of Quilt Lake. It is the ultimate goal. After finally uncovering the locations of the components to build the power suit and traverse the desk, I realize now I've become too old to attempt this journey on my own. Perhaps a younger adventure can stand on my shoulders and find out when I started. I can only hope I have the... Why don't we just... I have the heart to let him. What if it's a she? I like how it says... I like how it says him. <laughs> like, he's just like... He prefers males. Open the shop. Go buy the pirate and the hazmat. I will use the pirate for now. Go. I'm gonna pop the boat over here and I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it there for a while. And these and there's like, these patches of bubbles that can refill your air slightly when you're low. I think when you have like a quarter of air left. You know I just realized I'm explaining a lot for a game that probably no one here is gonna play. Oh sir. Need to check a very important mission. What is it? You need to find proof they're all bronze bin as a teddy bear. I will bring you the proof, Captain. Hello. This is just a generic Roblox character. I'm looking for a legendary guitar. I found it first. Aim your price though. My partner has gone missing the caves. I couldn't find him. Yeah, by the way, if you couldn't find a partner in here, I'm gonna leave this all uncut for you. Just to show you how much difficulty she had finding him. Yeah, she couldn't swim in a fucking straight line. Give me the guitar. I'm scribble this car, but you've earned it. Credit me on your first album. I like this guitar because it plays Zelda sound effects. Pirate Cove. Got the skelly's heart. And down here, the purple ice crown. Got a parrot over here. I need to keep my eyes on the horizon. Yeah, this is the horizon. It's just a it's just a cave. You can you can take a break, parrot. Don't worry. Very important mission for you, the highest of priority. What is it? I lost my hat. Okay. So the ship of a huge metal. Beast when a glowing fish now down my head, so it's the sewer. I will risk my life and burn you that hat. We'll grab that. Pretty sure if you go through here, there's a coin there, and up here there should be another coin and some treasure. I know you're not a pirate, and I don't care. You want me to free you? Yes. My name is Captain Rampage, and they committed beauty to overthrow me. With a name like Captain Rampage? Never. You catch over the ghost ship, his key in his cabin, find a way in the key. Is it for me? The gold necklace find me, it's yours. I will get the key. Like a snappy. Got it. Hello, are you bronze bird? Don't know you're dead trying to get my house. I just had two break-ins last week. Don't worry, I won't. Like. Better not. I am my on you. All the bronze bird will not be stolen from. Hehehehe. <laughs> He has the teddy bear, he has the teddy bear. Hey man. What's with teddy bear? Cash. Where are your parts? On your part two? Wait a minute. Oh, that's my cue to leave. Look how you can see you destroyed me. You got a total life jacket on your side. I do, you dirty bird. We can 
so... Not as much as I thought, but that's fine. Yeah, you found the guitar. Congrats. You could do it. Yeah, now I can play Zelda songs. So play this the kingdom, okay? I'm not gonna go for it anymore. Just play the game. I'm gonna leave the boat here as a boss travel. But you know what I can do? I can just be so insanely fast. There's a cave on there on the um the waterfall that just popped in. Over here, I believe. Yeah, anything in the water. No, it doesn't look like anything in the water. I think I'm around halfway done with the game already. How long has it been? Jesus, 49 minutes. Oh my god. I've been got what 46 artifacts and I've been done for 49 minutes. Holy, I'm sick of it. Alright, put on this. So, so we don't get radiation poisoning. Should be something in here. We've got the captain's log. SS Archer, on so February 14th, 1974. Missy writing, hard to make out. I write this from the Pacific Ocean near Point Nemo. The storm has fell upon us. The normal waves batter up the hull, each one larger than the last. Storm clouds below, below overhead, barging us with rain and only getting more determined as they continue to drop their payload. Lightning strikes our ship. Our crew is panicking to weather the storm with the and bail the water spilling over the sides. The sky is dark, with a dark green hue. Green smoke clouds swirl into a storm over us. The sea goes bright green. I've never heard talk this phenomenon, probably because anyone who is levelless to see the light of day. I think I'm living through to the end of one of these higher horror stories here that ships at sea. The ones with a catastrophic fate. Reduce the fable of SS Archery's maiden voyage. Sounds like a skill issue, man, not gonna lie. <laughs> Just like that, that's also a skill issue. Yeah, this is the first point of the game where it starts to get a little bit eerie. Please help us. Get us to our son back. Where's he gone? So with the sewer tunnels, we can't find him anywhere. I will bring back your son. Because I am a good man. There's another ocean tank over there. I might get that one when I'm done with the sewer. First over here. Got a radioactive robot. And here's the power cell. Squeeze through here. There's probably an easy way to do that, but whatever. Hello, Gafulu. Human, drop the crippling fear act and please help me. Dear God, what are you? Seriously? I'm Kafulu, my name is to be so feared. Forget it, please send me up. Okay. There's no link for cosmic doombies to turn to one of the one I decade long nap. Or if it's gone, you want me to find it. I'll bring you great many gold coins that will from sailors of eaten. I'll find your egg. It's just in the sewer, stuff tends to get lost down there. I'll be surprised if it's still an egg. So considering it's like, you know, he said it himself, it's a decade long sleep and we have a team of two divers there. Which is probably better, because um, in real life you should never dive alone. And, um, what am I doing? Who's the idiot now? Yep, I'm at the point where I can start taking those bubbles now. And there's the fish. There's a blockade over there. Pretty sure here should be, um... Yep, got the radioactive egg. Oh. Yep. Captain, put the power captain out. Okay, those bubbles don't work. Yeah, that's pretty sure the sewer is. Here's your son. Didn't do it for the reward. Yep, I want the headphones. I'm, I am going to um, collect the oxygen tank, and holy, that's a lot of air. Alright, Kafulu, I've got your egg. 100 gold coins, I don't know. Give a cup of tea. I don't really think I can drink tea underwater. Well, not, if I'm pretty sure if I take this helmet out, I'm just starting to get radiation poisoning. We're going back down. Hmm? I thought I saw something, never mind. Here's your hat, sir. Green now. Okay, 
worth my effort. So I got like a true pirate. And I'll take it for a change of mind. Got the neck of gold, got the cell key, got a seven jeweled circlet. Key, don't just stand there and lock the door. So what? I'll let you draw my crunk at version of these scum. I'll stick the necklace. So, it's on the ground. You're messing up. I think I'll just stay here while I'm going to my revenge, put the end to 7 free. Yeah, I'm sure they'll notice the, the massive door just swung open like that. I'm sure they won't notice that, don't worry. I'm gonna park my boat next to this, guys, because this is pretty sure where the lava area is. Walk back to the beach, sell all my stuff. 237? Nice. Go back to the shack, refill my air tank. First, sure I can buy them both. Yes, I can. I am literally speed running this game. I completely forgot about the alien shuttle here. So that proves aliens are canon in this universe. I'm pretty sure this house holds your yeah, astronaut helmet and a user's journal. Galactic exploration mission log. Day one. I, Henry Vita, have crash landed in this of alien plant. The air here is toxic to me. In fact, it doesn't appear to be air at all. It appears to be some sort of liquid, so I must keep your helmet off and out. Day two. Days are short here. I estimate one day is about eight half the days on my home planet. Also, it turns out the liquid as well as just water. So all I need is my echo breather to survive. It's very hot here where I am though, so I must keep my suit on. I plan to go this one today and discover what the surface is like. There is one. What's excited to turn on events that have led me to be here? So there's probably an alien roaming around somewhere. But whatever, that's like the least of my concerns. I'm also gonna be coming back here like I'm making like two or three round trips because there's a lot of collectibles here. I got a first playthrough, this is just Collectathon City. Look at that. I only have three more spaces in my bag already. Oh got the hot steam, gotta aware of that because I'm pretty sure that kills you quickly. And oh my god, my bag's already full. So yeah, it's time to sell. Just like that, 273 bucks. It's time to go inside this lava cave here. I don't think there's gonna be like nearly as much stuff in here. But um Might be dangerous being around these coins. I'm pretty sure that's the lava reactor. There we go, but now we can uh, make the power suit. So there's the steam, so we'll watch out for that. Oh I was about to miss that, thank you, pop up. I believe that's already everything. I'm gonna park my boat here as a, as a warp point. I'm gonna go down a bit because I've got some points there. Eh, it's alright. Do you know what? I might as well get the extra air here since I mean I'm not really gonna be using it in the air scales. I'm pretty sure there's an item down here that I missed. Yep. I also think I said there'll be like yeah, something up here. Sell my stuff back to the shack. Got the parts of the super scuba. Build it for me. Come back in five minutes. And while he's doing that, I'll just scavenge some more. I'll just do some coin scavenger around here. And oh my god, how did I miss those? Yeah, I also missed this. Ugh. Oh god. Him. I forgot he was in this game. Maybe I erased it from memory by choice, I don't know. I just forgot he was in this game. The suit isn't ready yet. Oh. Hello, sir. Oh, I see you have the Aqua Breather. Huh. Huh. So you're a baby. I got the suits complete. Here we are. The ice cave. We can't get in yet. We'll the temple entry note. We need three orbs from the surrounding caves. Talk to you. I haven't bought an ice pick. Let's do that. Now, we can break ice blocks in the area. Go. Climbed obstacles like steam in here. Just collect that through the wall. Oh my god, it. 
Yeah, I'm probably gonna be leaving and returning a lot. I'm gonna swim. Up. Okay, I thought that was like that was like cold, cold steam for a moment. Careful. The red orb. Okay. Don't spot me, please, please. Thank you. Oh no, it spotted me. Please. Thank you. Okay, I kind of gave a pursuit, so it didn't really matter too much. All money's worth it. Actually, never mind, I take that back. We have a golem head here. You there, find myself to be a pickle. Appears I've been set has been separated from Woody. It's got an interesting case when a sherry figure came in, I had some for the chance to react. Sounds like a dangerous character. Well, nobody can oppose such a fierce my skull. I'm um, a chance. Oh! Take it back. I think I'm gonna get the orb first. Got another artifact. The shield there, take that. There it is. If I die here, I'm gonna be so upset. 60 cash. I'm gonna find a bit more, but that's fine. 401 cash. Sheesh. Let's place the orbs. And we have access. Hi, Daver. Penguin piece the name, and I'm an adventure like you. No, what you say. Looking for an ancient penguin artifact which holds significance to my penguin tribe. And you want me to look for it? What kind of corridors? I can. I can find it for you. It looks like a penguin shaped vase. There are two corridors that lead to the temple interior. Besides the forum, each one. Oh, treasure. Tons. An artifact deep side that opens an Atlantean vault. I'll stay away from that though. Sounds dangerous. Well, you don't realize who you're talking to. Now, hold on, I actually don't remember, I actually don't remember the way here. But at least the traps are way clearer. <laughs> That's how to. Oh, I actually took some damage. I actually took some damage. Thank God I got out of that quickly, or else. Yeah, that would have been fatal. I'm going to die here, so I assume we just ran out of air. Couldn't even grab the bubbles there. That's an elbowzo moment. Can I grab this through the wall? No, I can't. There she is. We've got the Atlantean Vault Key and Sword of the Winter Winds. Alright, Penguin Peak. Uh. Okay, we got a. Um, no glitch there. I don't think you really need help. Oh, he's following me. I'll well, see you, I guess. Oh, I'm zooming. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that two stuff in four. What more? I must have missed one of them. To the brave explorer, our future is at stake. A mysterious enemy of malevolent inter intent has awakened an ancient cosmic entry from the depths of the sea. We now threaten to destroy all of Atlantean civilization. All Atlanteans have returned to the great city and are at this very minute caught in a tremendous battle against this memorable opponent. Whomever reads this message may be our far only hope at that refuge. Please take the Crow Lake connection to the lost sea and visit our hidden city of Atlantis. You will be allowed entry. We must do all our power to save Atlantis and keep its souls from being destroyed. Your arrival is highly anticipated. Signed, F.A. Well, I suppose if it's that anticipated, I shouldn't keep them waiting. I got to get to Atlantis. Right away. Oh yeah, that's right. And yep, we are officially done. Looking at our final time. Got 80 artifacts, the most out of everyone in the server. And we did it in 94 minutes, so yeah. It appears I'm just built different.